You got two? Two. Dang. Look at that. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Got you on video. <laughs> Yo. Yo. You, you want to see money? See money. Yo. 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 Money. Yo. What's up? You all the time, dude. dude, that's dude. awesome. That's awesome. Hey. Say what's up, man. Yo, Say what's up. Money. Yo, what oh do you think God. of this blitz? This is fucking Wait, sick. Oh yeah. God, that's sick. I'm it's gonna... sick. Oh, dude. Fuck, we actually caught shit. Yeah. I'm like following your ass everywhere. Right, I think we can all agree that this is like what it's all about right here. It's just like epic, uh, you know, bunker death is what it's all about. It's a really good day to be a surf fisherman. Look at that, man. Seriously, Merry Christmas. Merry frickin' Christmas. Damn, yeah, yo, let me lay them side by side real quick. Yeah, yours is close to 15. Oh yeah, yours has a few inches on mine. And a fatter gut. That's a nice one, man. Nice one. Not even hooked? Nah. The metal lip is under his fucking jaw. Damn, yeah, look at that. It like, that's crazy, dude. Yeah, it's not even hooked. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Big blue, Todd. Yeah. Yeah, dog. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Look at that blue. Big Thank blue. You guys. Big hey, blue. I get some credit. I pinned him down. You do? Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Crushing him, huh? There you go. I'll see you, dude. Did you get the 26 pounder earlier? 25, I think. 25? Yeah, right damn. Right How'd that go down? Snag and drop. Oh, yeah? Uh, oh, adult dude. bunker? Little bunker? Peanut. Yeah. Five feet out. Damn. Put real close. Yo, that's sick, dude. Nice yeah. fish. I, if my phone was a dead, I'd show you. Yeah, no, it's all good, yeah. I'm sure you'll see. I know what they look like. Can. That's a blue you got a blue fish, yeah. Fuck that. Ridiculous. I'm just going to stand here. This is just ridiculous. They're getting worked. These poor peanut bunker. Damn, that was a nice one. Damn. Huh. Yeah. Such chaos. I don't even want to catch this one. Let's see if we can shake him off. Oh, it's incredible. It's going off, son. It's going off, son. It's going off the chain. It's going nuts. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Bass Blitz 2016, baby. 2016. See if we can quickly hook up. Just ridiculous. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Oh, yeah, dude. Eat him up. Eat him up. Eat him up. All right. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Nice. Here, let me get a picture of your blue. Yeah. Hell yeah. Here, I'll get the pick of all picks. Yeah. All right. Thanks, sir. They're good. They're good. Smacking it out of the water. There we go. There we go. It's not like it's like a challenge to catch these things. They're pretty much. Well, tsunami talking poppers. All right, so this is kind of just a highlights video from a day that I didn't upload a video from, but it was going off like crazy, and uh, just, yeah, really big blitz. I was standing there catching fish. It got to the point where I didn't even want to catch them anymore. Like, I caught them, don't get me wrong, but I was wishing I had a camera to get underwater with because the feeding was just so impressive right at our feet and, like, could have got spectacular underwater footage. 
So I went out and I prepared myself by getting like a stick for my GoPro that I could hold under water. And then Thanksgiving Day, I was walking up to the beach, saw a similar sight. And, um, you know, it wasn't crazy when I first got there. I got here at like 2.30 on Thanksgiving Day and started catching fish. Don't get me wrong. There was a lot of fish, a lot of blitzing fish going on. But there wasn't the same like tight to shore, reckless blitz that was going on from that previous day that you had just saw. But um, the bait was in place, the fish were there, and it only took a little while before the tornado came through. You know, the, the big school bass pushed ashore and started just recklessly going, going in on these, on these bunker. And uh, that's when I, you know, changed it up, put the GoPro down underneath the water and started getting this footage that you saw from the Thanksgiving Day Massacre of uh, underwater feeding frenzy stuff. Um, the bunker were swimming for their lives, the bass were s moving quick, just, just gluttonously destroying these bunker, uh, a lot of the bass we caught that day were really fat, uh, mostly 25 to 30 inch fish, it seems like the fish that were closer to shore here were some smaller ones, uh, a lot of the fish I saw on the video of the underwater stuff looked like, like those two fish that just jumped out of the water, it looks like they were 22 inches or so, but, um, Regardless, it was very impressive to see, and it was definitely some stuff that I haven't seen before. Um, the size of this blitz and the duration of this blitz, and not just this one, but you know, a few of the ones that happened this fall, you know, were very impressive. Uh, so stuff that I've never seen. I was talking to guys on Thanksgiving, uh, like my buddy Dave G. He's been striper fishing the beaches since the '90s, and he was telling me that he hasn't seen like this you know, intensity and duration of blitz since then, since the 90s, the late 90s, and like another guy was telling me, you know, he hadn't seen it since the year 2000, so I wasn't around back then of fishing these beaches, so I don't know what it was like back then, but yeah, these three guys, OGs right here, they, they too were saying, yeah, like that was some, some stuff they really hadn't seen in years, and uh, one thing that is unique about 2016 is we had, um, you know, there's these bunker, and they they farm these bunker. They don't farm them. They harvest them for a variety of purposes, anywhere from, um, you know, feed for farm animals to omega-3 oils. You know, there's like a big um, reduction fishery that goes out and nets tons and tons of these bunker. And in 2012, they initiated a setback of harvests for the commercial fleet um, I think since 2012, like over the past four years, that there has been a 35% or 33% uh, reduction in harvest allowed for the commercial fishermen. So what that means is that they have lifted, you know, the pressure on these on these bunker, allowing them to spawn in greater numbers and just to exist in greater numbers. So the population of the bunker is up. You know, it's at a high point from the past five, maybe even ten years. I don't know, but. Uh, I mean, I haven't seen scenes like this, like just intense feeding like this in ever in my life. And um, it was really cool, man. Fall 2016 had this going on. Um, there was stuff going on like this in Jersey, in New York. Um, I didn't really hear too much about like Connecticut, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, or like all the way up to Nova Scotia where they get these fish. But, you know, here on the Striper Coast in the Northeast, like we definitely got a good chunk of blitz this fall. And it was a good time. Everyone got in on it, enjoyed it. You know, if you weren't there the one day, you could have got it the next day. And uh, shout out to anyone I saw on the beach this year. Uh, you guys, like, definitely made my season better. Like, running into you guys, watching my videos, being like, yo, what's up, see money watch your videos. You're like, that's, that was awesome. And uh, I'm doing a giveaway tomorrow. I'm giving away uh, one of the rods that I've been using, that Pompano Bay rod. We're going to give away, like, the exact same model that I have tomorrow some point tomorrow, probably, I want to say, 5 o'clock in the afternoon, like, look out for a giveaway video, uh, just want to give you fair warning, because it'll be the kind of thing where you're going to want to see it when it pops up, because it's like, you're going to have to guess the weight of this fish, and whoever guesses the white, right weight, it's going to win the rod, so, stay tuned for that, uh, it's 30 degrees outside right now, there's like snow on the ground, accidents out there, winter is here, the stripers are gone, hopefully we all make it through this winter. Thanks for watching the Sea Money Fishing YouTube channel this season, and I will see you guys in 2017.
mais, mais.